Hi there, I'm Amy Hanton, the cooking mom, and I'm really excited because we're making ribs. And I have to tell you, my family absolutely loves ribs, but you know what? Sometimes they can be a bit of a pain to make, especially in the middle of the winter when you're really craving that summer taste of barbecue ribs on the grill. But you know what? I'm gonna show you how to do Festival's ribs on the stick right in your oven. Couldn't be easier. My family loves them and yours will too. Super simple. Now, first of all, we're gonna make a quick homemade barbecue sauce because sometimes, you know, you just don't have a bottle of barbecue sauce in your pantry and it's so easy to whip up a homemade sauce. Super simple. You probably already have everything you need right now at home. We're gonna start out with some ketchup, about a cup of ketchup, and then We've got a little bit of mustard, a few tablespoons, quarter cup of brown sugar, just to sweeten it all up a little bit. You could do honey too. And the last thing, a tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. So I'm just gonna give that a quick stir, let it all come together and it's that easy. I don't know about you, but I gotta have some barbecue sauce on my ribs. See, we're almost there. Okay, turn down the heat and we'll get back to you in just a minute. Now, back to the festival ribs on a stick. I absolutely love these because, you know, they're just so easy. It's really hard to, to mess up this recipe. Basically, we're gonna bake them in the oven. I've got my oven preheated to 325 degrees. And the pork uh, association, the Wisconsin pork producers do such a great job to make this, these uh, pork these days so nice and lean that it's a good idea to drizzle the ribs on a stick with a little bit of olive oil so they don't get dried out. And then I like to season them with kosher salt and pepper. And by the way, these ribs on a stick are the center cut of a pork loin roast. So just the best of the best. And then they put the sticks in there just to make them easy to eat so they're boneless and wonderful. Okay, at this point, this goes into again that preheated 325 degree oven and they bake for about 45 to 50 minutes. You can actually get these marinated in barbecue sauce or plain, these ribs on a stick. But again, I still like to add a little sauce at the end. So these just came out of the oven and they look wonderful and juicy and tender. But now we're gonna throw them back in the oven with a little bit of this homemade wonderful barbecue sauce on top or you could do your favorite store-bought bottled barbecue sauce, either way. So we're just gonna put a little bit of sauce, spoon it right on top of the ribs on a stick. And at this point, this goes back into the oven until that sauce gets all nice and caramelized and wonderful for another 15 to 20 minutes. So here we go. I'm so excited about these. They just look delicious. One really important thing that you need to do when it comes to cooking pork is make sure the internal temperature of these ribs on a stick is up to 160 degrees. So use your little meat thermometer and make sure you're up to 160. What are we gonna serve these with? Well, we gotta serve them with Festival's wonderful twice baked potatoes with real Wisconsin cheddar cheese and a little bacon on top too. So good. And then maybe some broccoli or a salad. So. There you go, festival, ribs on a stick, so good. Ribs don't have to be tough and they don't have to be just a summertime thing. Bake them right in your oven, they're delicious.